I pretty much recorded everything on We Sing, We Dance, We Steal Things on this guitar. We have registered over 1 million voters. There it is, there's all my keys. This hangs up in the bathroom. Let's look at your stuff, man. Hey. I'm gonna go ahead and play rock and tell. This is like show and tell, but with music memorabilia. Jason Mraz, what do you got for me? Okay, um, speaking of waitress, when I left the theater, they gave me a stethoscope, right? A commemorative stethoscope with, um, with over 100,000 patients served. That's about how many tickets were sold during my run. And my, the best part, is the audience could write these guest checks and this audience member said i need to schedule an appointment with the doctor hey and these are all beautiful notes written by um, audience members um, that are just complimentary so whenever i'm down i can just pull off a guest check and say hey 10 times in concert one time on broadway you are a mrazing i love it well I done just, i just love this so this hangs up in the bathroom of course <laughs> And they're like um, self-help mantras. Have you ever noticed one that's gone missing? Like, has someone ever stolen one? You know, I, I, I don't know. But I assume that if they did, they really needed it. Or they used it as toilet paper. Who knows? And then they really needed it. They really needed it. So I'm okay with that. I have no attachment. I can't take anything with me to the afterlife. So, you know, I'm enjoying it now while it's here. But, okay, the next thing I'd like to show you is I have saved every hotel key since I was in high school. So, um, you know, and when I started, they were in, they were actually keys. keys. You know, when I That's first started I thinking, touring, I like, you stole metal. They, yeah, they gave us metal keys, but then it shifted to plastic keys. And I, I'm going to have to pick this up, but oh man, I have this like display case filled with keys. And there's a couple of other random things, like there's an old grocery store key, but, <laughs> but there it is. There's all my keys. It, it weighs a lot. And um, it has a little drop slot in the top. So every time I come home from tour, I just drop the key into the thing and it's halfway full. Um, I don't know why. I don't know what I'm doing with all these keys. I think maybe one day I'll build like a house of cards or a hotel of cards and maybe it'll be an art installation. Or I'm going to shingle my roof with it or I'll build birdhouses in my retirement. Sure. And they'll be made out of hotel keys. A bird hotel. I'm going to be making bird hotels in my retirement. So, uh, Speaking of hotels, what amenity do you like the most? Like when you open up the door and you see X, Y, or Z and you go, yeah, I like this room. Yeah, the do not disturb sign. <laughs> I just, mm, I love it. Just do not bother me. Don't make up my room. Don't, don't come in. I'm going to, I'm going to do my thing. Uh, yeah, I'm, I, I don't know, a window that opens, that would be amazing. Back in the day, they all opened, but uh, I guess some people screwed it up for the rest of us. So. Yep, yep. All right, before we wrap up, what other items do you got? I thought about all the many awards that I've received, and there are many, and I'm so grateful to be acknowledged for things, but this one I think is just really unique, and it's from my friends at Headcount, and over the last 15 years, uh, our fans, uh, through concert attendance and um, clicking some of the links we've shared, we have registered over 1 million voters. And I just think that is so freaking cool uh, because that's how we change the world. You know, at least that's how we get involved and engage. And um, so I was really touched to know that, you know, it's really added up through the years. So when, uh, to all the artists out there, whatever you're passionate about, whatever you're pursuing, you know that it works little by little. It works. The message you you convey, it does connect. And so this little this little award here, while humble and means it means very little, you know, but it also means a lot to know that um, we engaged a lot of people to just raise their voice and go go be heard. So I love that. Before I close it out, I, I see a guitar in the background. Is that anything significant? Is that the one that you write up the new tunes with? Yes, I've had this guitar since 2004. I recorded the Mr. A to Z album with it, and it's been my homie ever since. Um, we, I pretty much recorded everything on We Sing, We Dance, We Steal Things on this guitar. And um, 
I, I now actually replicate this guitar. I have a signature line with Taylor. Um, it's pretty much identical, except I did some some Zodiac um, cosmetics to the face of it. But the wood and the the style, everything is is the same. Um, I just I just love this guitar. And much like Willie Nelson's the hole in Willie Nelson's guitar, I'm I'm getting there. And that's that's due to a really bad habit of keeping my pinky finger right here when I play. And through the years, it's just worn out. But uh, she likes it. Does this does this uh, go out on the tour with you, or is this a "Don't leave the house, I'm afraid to lose it" guitar? Um, it does come out. Um, not all tours. It just depends on where we're going, how I'm feeling. Um, again, in this in this interview, I said, you know, I can't take it with me to the afterlife. I'm not attached, so. Sometimes I'm, I, I go out on tour with that. I'm like, I only want this guitar. This is the only guitar I want to play. I won't switch guitars at all. And then other tours, I say, you know what? Something's telling me I'm just going to leave this one at home. And I'm going to test out a few other guitars. Um, I, have a, I have a backup of this should anything happen. But this is really the one. This is just, it's, it's got a lot of love, a lot of wear and tear. Um, it's coming up on 20 years old. So these tailors, while it's such a new guitar company, mm -hmm. they are finally reaching that nice aged, aged feel that guitar only gets better as it gets older. Uh, Jason, thank you so much for mm -hmm. hanging out today. Uh, the tour, it's Look for the Good Live. People can get okay. tickets now. The deluxe album, Look for the Good, is available. And if you just want to go back just to the original Look for the Good, they can get their hands on that as well, right? That's right. But you might as well go for the Look for the Good Deluxe because you still get the original 12, but you get plus six very, very interesting new songs. Um, I'm yours. Uh, be Where Your Feet Are. That's one of my favorite tunes. And it's my advice to everyone out there when you're going, what should I do? Just be where your feet are and enjoy the ride. Well, I enjoyed the ride today talking to you. Thanks so much, Jason. It was my pleasure. pleasure. Thanks for the chat. Hey there, thanks for watching Access TV. Subscribe, follow, like, and do all the good stuff. And make sure you leave a comment below. I don't know, just let us know what your favorite Access TV show is, or who your favorite bands are, and what artists you're into, or just say hi, man. I'd like to be told hi. We love hearing from you, that's the point, all right? Keep it coming.